Hi guys, I'm back again. I won't stop saying that now because if I get in the rhythm of doing this a bit more and keeping vlogging, then I'm not gonna need to keep saying I'm back. Uh, we are going for some arena hire today and I am riding George's horse, Tilly. Tilly is a boy. His name is Billy Tortilla, is his show name. But yeah, I'm uh, George's really busy with work at the moment and today he's playing golf, so I get to ride Tilly. Ha ha. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to ride Tilly very well. He's incredibly strong and a bit of a bloke, a guy's horse. But we'll, uh, we're going to give it a try. We're going to see. I've got a Pelham <laughs> and uh, we're going to see how we get on. But just kind of going to have a nice ride. Meg is coming with uh, one of the training liveries boots and she's going to be riding him. He has been coming back from an injury. So uh, it's been a little while since he's been out. So the girls have been busy, busy getting them all ready. Here they are. Not in focus. Jesus. Here they are. Ready to go. We have Boots wearing his very handsome dry rug just in case he gets a bit warm. Meg, hi Meg, Lucy, Lily and Tilly, the horse I'm not going to be able to have any brakes on. Oh they look very smart. Well done guys for getting them all clean. Right, let's go. We, who are we going to put on first? Tilly's used to going on the outside. Tilly's used to going on the outside, absolutely right. Oh, boots, oh, boots the boots are a bit weird. <laughs> One, two, he says the boots are weird too. Oh, thanks Tilly. Just farted at me. Uh, I'm just trying to look around seeing if we've forgotten anything. I don't think we have. We're going to uh, Wake's End. We've actually been there before. You will remember uh, we took Tilly and Zora there before. Excuse me, Boots. You're not going to the vets. You're not going to the vets. I promise. Good boy. A little hesitant. Um, and yeah, uh, so we're going there. It's a lovely arena. And then I'm actually going to teach a couple of lessons straight after. So the boys will just hang out on the horse box. Anyway, so that's that's the plan. We're going to go for some arena hire. We're going to, I'm probably going to jump some small jumps and see how we get on. And I'll take you with me. Off on an adventure again. Just stop for some petrol, diesel even. Uh, they're such good friends, these two. They travel so nicely. Happy little chappies. I've just been eating my packed lunch that I brought myself. Honestly, I'm so organized today. You feel much more organized these days. Um, and I've had a lovely morning. I've trained some horses and um, I had uh, one of the owners of one of the horses come um, and she brought her daughter with her and her daughter is 10 and her daughter did some of the groundwork with her pony who I'm backing at the moment and it was my little hark cope, so sweet. Um, while I'm here, I just want to talk to you guys about merchandise so my website is now live which is super exciting and you can buy a hoodie so uh this is the heather gray it's organic uh recycled cotton and they are so soft they've got this lovely like soft fluffy bit on them and oh, they're so nice i wear them all the time they're really tough you know like for horsey stuff they're really tough and they say training every step on the back i'll have to get some uh, images of them of it when i get there i can't film my own back um and we've got beanie hats and t-shirts and the quarter zips that i wear as well all the time and caps and groundwork flags so yeah head over www.hackatechwine.co.uk and you can get yourself some merch Finally, my goodness me, it's taken a long time. You can also buy an Equitex that I will show you today, the special edition Equitex. You can have it in any cut, any material. So you can have it either in the velvet or the air tech, uh, but it's the navy blue with the silver around the edge. It is so beautiful. Um, I'll have to show you guys. So that is a special order, that one, but um, you can access that through my website. So yeah, I'm really, really happy to have it all live now and uh, ready to go. It's exciting and I thank you if you have already ordered. It means so much to me. The support I get with things like that allows me to do more of this, you know, to share more of my life because um, it means I 
have more time to myself basically because I'm not having to race all over the country and teach for example that kind of thing so it's a balance basically it allows me to do more of this bit which I do love so yeah if you have supported me or thinking of supporting me then thank you because it allows me to do all of this and that's important because that's what I want to do I want to be able to share what I'm doing with you guys and it's hard to do that without other streams of income right I need to pull forward right yeah. We have arrived. <laughs> Lovely little arena. Richard, you should introduce yourself. Oh, yeah. It's first vlog. Feeling a little bit nervous, guys, but um, it's good so to see you all. I'm I'm Meg I'm Megan's Megan's boyfriend, by the way. So sorry if anyone's heartbroken. <laughs> probably, probably not. Horse person, yeah, horse getting off trailer. There's another horse. Done a good job of trimming him. We ever did Tilly. Megan, she's really no, nice. very good at the hair cutting these days, isn't she? Maybe you should let her cut your hair. <laughs> Why does it need a cut? Yeah. Our music. Our lovely Equitex saddle pads. Good. Yeah. Fun. Good branding. So this is the special coloured Equitex for uh, Hacker yes. Equine. Show them that. Is this this exclusive for Hacker Equine. Limited. Limited edition. That feels lovely. Gorgeous. Chrome, chrome Equitex badging. Where, where can we get these? Where can we pick these up?
go. That was great. It's the cameraman himself. That was really positive. I could stop. There were some moments. I don't know whether I'll have put them in because they were a bit embarrassing, like when he just decided on his own stride, but um, learning. And I'm gonna take him for some training next, I think. We learned to ride you, big strong bugger. But he done half jump. Honestly, nearly fell off once. Perfect. Right, I've now got to teach these two humans. Oh, I think the pony went on. And there was a pony that wasn't loading that I was gonna help with, but they got it on. So, yeah, I'll give you a debrief when I get back in the box after teaching. Goodbye. Just got home, just unloading. Um, I've actually got to teach a lesson now. Someone's come from far away for a lesson. So um, I'm gonna do that and then I'll give you guys a debrief. But maybe I don't have to because maybe you guys saw enough. I don't know, I won't finish this video here. I'll finish it when I get back in the car later to go home. Oh, I just banged my finger. Oh, that really hurt. You good boy, Bootsy. He says, yeah, I like going out and doing fun stuff. It's my favorite. But anyway, I'll be back shortly. Bye. Hi, uh, <laughs> me again. I mean, you've just said, been watching this video and you've got no idea why I'm, it's dark now. This video I'm filming now is way later um, and I uh, completely forgot to finish this video. It's how bad I am at YouTube these days. It's actually um, a Thursday evening and I'm just on my way to the food shop, supermarket, to get dinner. So anyway, here I am. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. I certainly enjoyed making it. It was very interesting riding George's horse and it's quite interesting now looking back and watching the footage, um, I definitely made some errors and I'm really looking forward to having some training on him. He's quite a, he's quite an interesting horse to ride. He had an old, he has an old stifle injury that doesn't stop him doing what he's doing, but um, landing on the right cantilede, it does stop that from happening. Um, so that's why he sometimes looks a bit disjointed and dis, uh, he goes disunited a lot. So it's quite interesting riding a horse like that and like learning about how to help him basically. But the more relaxed he is, the better he is, which is normally always the way. Um, so yeah, so I'm really looking forward to taking him for some training and then maybe going to a show. Goodness me, I don't. I think I'd be really nervous if I did that. But anyway, maybe we'll get to that. Um, I just feel very lucky to have to be able to ride him a bit and do that um, making the most of George being busy so I do hope you enjoyed this video I really hope that you will support my shop uh, on my website and if you don't want to buy anything from the shop totally fine but I'd love for you to check out my website There's lots about what I do um, link to my uh, training online training page and um, just loads of information about me, a bit about my history, a bit about what I do, what we do at Hackett Equine with the training livery, uh, and maybe I'll be able to help you. Maybe you're in the UK and you're looking for someone to maybe back your young horse or come for some problem solving or just for some competition livery. Anyway, there's all the information is on there. www.hackettequine.co.uk and uh, I would love to see, hear your feedback. You know, leave me a comment below if you like the website or thought something about the website, I'd love to hear it. Um, thank you again for supporting my channel and for being here and for watching me talk stuff to you guys. I massively appreciate it. I will see you guys very soon with the next video. Thank you again for being here. Bye for now. <laughs>